Hello. Today, Road to GH will reveal the exciting details of General Hospital for Thursday, September 26, 2024. First, Lucky has been eagerly awaiting the moment to return home, a place filled with family memories and love. However, that excitement is quickly replaced by pain and worry when he receives news from home. His sister, Lulu, whom he deeply loves and has always been close to, is facing a severe health condition. Her liver is weakening, and the doctors have given a grim prognosis. Time might be running out for Lulu, leaving Lucky feeling helpless and devastated that he cannot be by her side during this difficult time. Each passing day fills Lucky with more anxiety, his heart aching as he imagines a future without Lulu. He only hopes he can return in time to be with her, even if it is just for her final moments. Lucky's heartache deepens not only because of Lulu's deteriorating health, but also because he knows he is one of the few people who can help his sister. His liver is a match for Lulu, but being far away makes Lucky feel powerless and torn inside. He knows that if he could just be there, he could save his sister by donating part of his liver. This is both a hope and a heavy burden for him, as time is running out and the opportunity to save Lulu seems to be slipping away. Each day, Lucky grows more anguished as he thinks about how he could save Lulu, but the distance and current circumstances prevent him from acting immediately. His heart twists in helplessness and fear as time passes, and he still hasn't been able to do anything to save his beloved sister. Second, Anna and Jason have embarked on a dangerous journey to find Lucky, who disappeared under mysterious circumstances. From the very start, they faced countless unforeseen challenges. Clues have led them into perilous situations, from confronting dangerous enemies to navigating difficult and harsh terrains. Every step forward is paid for in effort and intellect, sometimes even in risk-taking, but thanks to persistence and luck, they always manage to overcome the challenges miraculously. However, despite their tireless efforts and all the leads they have followed, Anna and Jason have yet to find any trace of Lucky. As each day passes, their hope of finding him seems to grow slimmer. Both of them start to feel the tension and pressure as time runs out. They are not only struggling to find Lucky, but also racing against time because Lulu's health is worsening. Lulu is in critical condition, and Lucky may be the only person who can save her by donating his liver. This truth makes the situation even more severe, as Anna and Jason understand that if they don't find Lucky in time, not only Lulu, but the whole family could face a great tragedy. Phone calls from home constantly update them on Lulu's condition, weighing down their minds with worry. They know that Lulu's time is running out, and if they don't find Lucky soon, all hope will be lost. Third, Stella has been away from Port Charles for a long time, and her absence has left a void in the lives of those around her. When news of her return reaches the town, joy and excitement spread, especially for Tracy, an old friend who has always cherished their deep friendship. Tracy, who rarely shows much emotion, this time cannot hide her excitement at the thought of reuniting with Stella. They shared wonderful memories in the past, and though many years have passed, their friendship remains as strong as ever. Stella's return is not just a major event for Tracy, but also brings warmth and reconnection among familiar faces. Tracy has been reminiscing about the times they supported each other through hardships, laughed together, and shared serious moments. Now, with Stella's return, Tracy feels like a missing piece of her life has been restored, and she cannot wait to reminisce on old memories and create new ones in the future. Fourth, Michael and Willow are having a gentle conversation, sharing their thoughts and emotions in an intimate moment. They seem deeply focused on their dialogue, creating a peaceful space between them. However, the atmosphere suddenly changes when Drew unexpectedly interrupts without any warning. His sudden appearance makes things awkward, and neither Michael nor Willow knows how to react. Although Drew didn't mean to, his words and actions have made both Michael and Willow uncomfortable. All three stand there, silent for a moment, each feeling the tension in the air. Michael glances at Willow, trying to find a way to resolve the situation without making things worse, while Willow is also unsure of what to say to ease the awkwardness. Drew, realizing that he has caused this tension, seems uncomfortable but unsure of how to fix the mistake. 
the three remain in an uneasy silence, and the situation becomes more tense as no one can break the awkward atmosphere. Finally, Ned, who is always curious and eager to know everything about his family, is completely shocked when he learns that Gio is Brooklyn's son, which means Gio is his grandson. This revelation leaves Ned truly stunned, as he never imagined that Brooklyn, his daughter, could keep such a huge secret without telling him. Realizing he has a grandson he's never met fills Ned with complex emotions. He is surprised but also feels abandoned for not being informed of such an important matter. His mind races with questions. Why did Brooklyn keep this secret? Why wasn't he told sooner? And why is he only finding out now that Gio is his grandson?